It was the middle of the night, in Midtown. To be more precise, it was right now. The place was a cozy dump famous for its warm coffee, and it didn't hurt that the napkins were free. I was waiting to meet my latest client, Jane Archer. She'd hired me to investigate her husband's grisly murder homicide. An act of violence made all the more senseless by its redundancy. It was a classic case of overkill. The sight of Jane Archer sent chills from my shoulders to my boulders. She was like a sister you wanted to have sex with. And what was it about her body that made me stare at her boobs? So what can you tell me about my husband? Mrs. Archer, are you sitting down for this? Yes. Ma'am, I won't sugarcoat it. Your late husband was born June 27th, 1979 to the owners of a struggling antique shop in Queens. By all accounts, he was a pretty gifted newborn, but then became an unremarkable student in preschool and performed without merit in kindergarten. Fast forward 30 years later and here we are today. I hope that provides some closure for you. I gave her a moment to let that sink in. Is that it? Well, I believe you know the rest. He was murdered. By who and why? It was painful to see her cry. So I got her a comforting strip of toilet paper from the gentleman's John. Get that. I don't want that. Look, Mrs. Archer, no amount of investigating is going to bring your husband back. But we can honor his memory by forgetting about him and moving on. God knows I'm not a wealthy man. I'm still paying off my student loan from the time I borrowed $400 from a college student. But, given the opportunity, I'll make one hell of a husband. And with that, I put all my card on the table. All I've learned here is that you're no detective. In fact, I'm not even sure you qualify as a person. It didn't take a private detective to see that I'd blown it. I walked back to my office as I tried to focus on the positive. If this is about the deli sandwiches, tell Farid I'll have his 11 bucks by Friday. We're not here to collect your lunch money, Gumshoe. Hand over Archer's statue, or we'll shoot you. Gumshoe. That word. It was shocking to hear it used so freely as a derogatory slur in 2016. In fact, nowadays, hearing it was unheard of. Was society... Bang. That word!